Hi everybody, this is Fred today. And what I'm going to do, I bought some of them. Yeah, some of those black powder bullets. What I do later is like take the, the tip off right here. Take a hot ice pick, and punch a hole through there hot and then pop pop it out of there, then I have a hollow point. But what I'm doing today, hold this over a minute. There they are. What I did was mark them. See the little marks on there? What I'm gonna do, take a Dremel, cut some notches in there. A little just notches, four notches. What it does is make it uh, going to expand a little faster. Those there. I'll do one of them right quick and show you. four marks there's four marks you see where i did that see when the impact of the bullet hits then that will be the that will be the that will be the weak point so what it does is like mushroom it'll mushroom help it mushroom faster i'm gonna take the tip off i've got some that i saved with, with the tip these 330 grain 50 caliber black powder and uh, what I'm doing is putting the notches so it, it will help it expand and mushroom a little faster like whenever it hits a deer or in any case if you're out hunting whatever animal you're hunting it expands a little bit that's, that's a heavy heavy ass bullet just cutting some notches Cutting notches on there. It does get a little hot, so that's what I'm gonna do. So what I'm doing is just kind of modifying a bullet where it will expand faster. Get over here like this. <laughs> Hold on to it a little bit, maybe. Maybe show it this way what I'm doing. Get her on that straight. that sound like the motor's going down winding down then that's that's how I know it's deep enough that one's done turn that off I really need gloves you can see where I put the notches on there on it Just some notches to help it uh, to expand. But like a 50 caliber hitting a, a deer or an animal, well, I kind of feel sorry for them because that's a, you know, like I said, a heavy bullet. I've been out there watering the watermelons and the tomatoes. So I didn't want to do a video of that. So I'm just showing you before and after. So what I'm going to do is like just take the tip off after I, after I grind these well, putting notches in them. After I put notches in these 
know these 50 caliber and, uh, and I'll take that tip off and make it a hollow point then just make it a hollow point and then I'm putting the notches right about in there right on those marks there and it will help it you know it, it'll be a little weak spot on the bullet but that hollow point uh, you know uh, it expands faster so that's what Fred's doing today so I want to thank y'all for watching this is Fred today just out here in the yard uh, watering the tomatoes watering the watermelons and I hope I grow a pretty good sized watermelon so yeah so yeah. if y'all want to buy the watermelon if one of them if some of them grow, then uh, yeah, I share a bite of watermelon. I want one all by myself so I can eat the heart out of them. That's the best part. I don't want to pick out no seeds. So, thanks for watching. Y'all have a good day. Y'all be safe. And, uh, and I guess the word of the day is uh, <coughs> uh, to remember a long time ago, you know like how it all started you know with the the stuff that the, the economy is and like the minimum wages like if you think it was made a long time ago here it is 2021 now really i don't know when it started the minimum wages a long time ago uh but since then like whatever date whatever year that was and here it is 2021 and all that money that they throwing around and stuff spending it or making up uh making up excuses about uh, what they gonna spend it on and stuff the minimum wages were a long time ago it don't look like it's kept up with the times if they started something why don't they increase it to make it better in this economy and stuff yeah, it started a long time ago, about minimum wages, whatever, and stuff, and they can spend billions on this and that, stuff that don't make no sense. Uh, look back like what I said before, look like the people come first. So thanks for watching. Maybe y'all might understand what I'm talking about. So uh, thanks for watching. Y'all have a good day. Yep. And remember, y'all be safe, y'all be strong, y'all be wise, and you be aware. Because if you don't, shit gonna hit the fan. So thanks for watching. Bye-bye.